This is the time for real wisdom. Lightning round. If Trump wins, how about bursting into tears and screaming fuck for the next 45 minutes? Well, America is crying tonight. I'm not sure how much of America, but a very, very significant portion. And I mean literally crying. Everybody is crying and so upset. And it is the end of their world. Feels like the end of the world. We were on uh, Lifetime last right. night. And I was uh, slowly getting drunk is what happened to me. How do we explain how this is possible? How did this happen? Experienced politician versus racist fake gynecologist. Everybody hates Get you, Get your abortions now. Such losers, such scum. We're going to be you fucked, know. and we're going to have to live with it. You're awake, by the way. You're not having a terrible, terrible dream. Also, you're not dead, and you haven't gone to hell. This is your life now. This is our election now. This is us. This is our country. This is a different earth yeah. today than it was 24 hours ago. It's a different place uh, because it just is different. The woman who President Obama called the most qualified person ever to run for the White House couldn't break through. The question remains, who can? Deeper concerns tonight that the world's shining light of democracy has gone dark. Decency <laughs> lost last night, and that's what's so uh, hurtful about this. This was a white lash. This was a white lash against a changing country. It was a white lash against a black president in part. And that's the part where the pain comes. I kind of push back against the advancement of African Americans, of Hispanics, and of Jones, women, such of a bunch of race writers. It is a, a mourning moment for, for those people, uh, and it is, a, it is a moment filled with fear. Because I'm on this network and people know my attitudes about things. They come up to me and they're scared, depressed, despair, desperate even. Um, almost clinging to me. It was a rough night for everybody, yeah. I think. Um, you know, we're worried. The people are worried. You know, okay, he's the president. Now what? It feels like we're trying to avoid the apocalypse and half of the country is voting for the asteroid. Is there a doomsday plan for a time like this? Please. Am I right to ask about a doomsday plan? Do you see this as a doomsday scenario? So if Donald Trump is democratically elected and your son is serving as a Marine, you wouldn't trust his life under that commander-in-chief? And Kane said, I wouldn't. That's a pretty extraordinary thing to say uh, if you have a son in the Marine Corps and that you don't trust the commander in chief. The they, people in the military defend the Constitution. I can't put, uh, I cannot put a, 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 I can't put a happy face on that. And, and that's my job. This is the first time throughout this entire race where I'm officially <laughs> my pants. <laughs> I, I genuinely do not understand how America can be this disorganized or this hateful. How do you govern when your whole campaign was built on the hatred of somebody else? From slavery to, you know, Nazism, we have faced challenges before to who we are as a people. Plus the Supreme Court, who knows where that's going to go. So the only checks and balances we have are us, the view. How are you supposed to be able to handle it? Did the best ad campaign, the best ground game. This is a shot against meritocracy, I think, because she merited everything. The normal way you standardize these things, she did what she supposed yeah, to do to yeah. win. You know, she was Hillary Clinton, the most qualified candidate, the best suited for the job, the best temperament. Now because we're hearing not a good candidate. History is put on hold yet again. We have no idea who won. And to cover our bases, we taped two different show opens. First up, here's the outcome I'm hoping for. Hillary Clinton is the next president of the United States. But just in case the unthinkable has happened and Donald Trump is our new president, the show open would look something like this. Oh, hello. 